14 Girl Trends That Guys Can't Stand Number 14. Gladiator Sandals Come summertime, every girl breaks out a pair of gladiator sandals. They come in all different shapes and sizes, and they look absolutely cute with outfits. Besides, they're light, comfortable, and fashionable, right? Well, not exactly. Sorry to burst your bubble, ladies, but guys hate them and think they're straight up ugly. Not only do they think they make you look like you belong in the Russell Crowe movie Gladiator, but it just seems like you're doing too much. While it does take forever to strap up your Gladiator footwear, some men claim that the strappy flat sandals can make a girl's legs appear short and stumpy. Some guys also don't understand the need for all those straps and believe these shoes should be locked up in the lion's den. Number 13. False Eyelashes if you want to create long and flirty eyelashes that will last all day, then falsies are the way to go. But you aren't fooling anyone, especially men who would prefer the real you. One minute, he's talking to a girl who notices hair falling off her eyes, and when he goes to grab it, he ends up yanking her whole falsie off, which leaves him confused and terrified that he actually pulled off your real eyelash. Another reason why guys hate false eyelashes is that they think it looks unnatural and itchy. Even worse, some guys have woke up to false eyelashes on their pillows, floors, and sinks in the following morning. Number 12. Chokers Remember back in the 90s when chokers were totally in style? From your favorite celebrity to all the girls in school, everyone owned this fashion favorite accessory. Well, fast forward to 2017 to where these babies have made a comeback. While every girl is enjoying this blast from the past, we think it complements our outfits and gives us a bit of an edge. But with guys, they have a bit of mixed emotions. First off, guys aren't a fan because they think it's too intense and looks uncomfortable to wear. They might get the wrong impression that we're actually being choked by these necklaces. Plus, most guys think that it's just recycled fashion that's really nothing new or different. What do you feel about chokers? Number 11. Sock Bun are you late for school and don't have time to do your hair? Well, the sock bun look is the perfect go-to look when you're in a rush. Plus, it doubles as an elegant updo when you're going out for the night. However, for some guys, they have a whole different take on the whole sock bun look. First off, guys don't understand that there's not always a sock in there. While you might incorporate an original sock in your hair, they don't know if we buy hair bun sponges at the mall or beauty supply stores. Some guys hate this hairstyle because it reminds them of a bird's nest or a plant that's getting ready to bloom. But despite the hate, this is a simple trend that girls stick to because it works for them. Number 10. Contouring when it comes to trying to create a slimmer face and a pronounced nose, contouring is every girl's best friend. This delicate makeup technique takes some time to master, and when done right, it can really enhance your face. But when it comes to makeup in general, guys just don't understand, and they have unanimously agreed that most girls can do without it. To men, the idea of thick, cakey makeup and layering it on the skin just doesn't sit well with them. Men believe that a lot of makeup can make you look worse and that it can even make you seem like a clown. While most men would say less is more, for us girls, makeup is all about just ourselves and wearing it to feel good on those days where we want to boost our confidence. Number 9. Big Sunglasses when it comes to the latest eyewear trend, you can't go wrong with a pair of big sunglasses, or so we thought. While most girls own a pair of oversized designer frames to keep the sun away and to look fashionable, guys simply want to toss your favorite pair of sunglasses in the trash. Most guys would argue that it makes you look like you have bug eyes and the big frames don't complement your face. It hides everything and makes it seem like the glasses are consuming your nose and mouth. Plus, it gives the impression that you're trying to hide something. And while you may be trying to conceal your face from the heat, your man would prefer some sunglasses that actually fit you. Number 8. Ruffles Ladies love rocking ruffles. They're frilly, girly, and fun. Whether it's on a dress or a blouse, ruffles add style and elegance to any outfit. But all guys have a universal message out there for you to hear and they want to make it loud and clear. Guys want you to steer away from the ruffles because it's unflattering on your body shape and they hate all the excess fabric. They feel it's purposeless and want to chop it all off. Plus, guys have mentioned that ruffles remind them of the bed skirts that belong under your bed mattress. If guys are comparing it to something as low as that, then they must really hate it. Tell me, ladies, what do you think of ruffles? Number 7. High-Waisted Shorts Girls absolutely love high-waisted shorts because they're fit, trendy, and most importantly, hide our stomachs and all our imperfections. But many guys beg to differ. Guys hate high-waisted shorts and say it's one of the worst trends because it looks like we've tried to salvage our favorite pair of jeans by converting them to shorts. Not only does it make it look cheap and crud, but they don't flatter our butts at all. Some guys have even referred to them as mom shorts, or worse, the granny panties of shorts. Wow, isn't that a bit harsh? Basically, what guys are trying to tell us is that they look unbalanced and would rather have us wear something that conforms to our body shape. But regardless of what most guys think, this isn't going to stop most ladies from putting on their high-waisted shorts. Number 6. 
fake tans. As soon as summer comes rolling in, most girls rush to get spray tans to achieve a naturally luminous glow. However, if you step out of the tanning bed looking orange and blotchy, most guys would run to the hills. No guy wants a girl looking like she's from the Jersey Shore. A bad spray tan can literally ruin your look and can leave you looking like a Cheeto puff for days, especially if the tan is too dark for your skin and leaves fine white lines. It can give you attention for all the wrong reasons. Most guys would agree there's nothing wrong with a little bit of bronzer and shimmer to tan your skin and a little sunlight can be healthy, but just remember not to overdo it. Number 5. Oversized Hats There's no better season than spring. Flowers are blooming, birds are chirping, and bright sunny days call for wide brim hats. They're our favorite accessory to wear at the pool or the beach because it does an excellent job of keeping the sun out of our face and protecting our skin from the heat. Plus, they're adorable and it goes well with any outfit. Not only does it call our inner JLo, but it's also perfect for keeping our hair at bay on a windy day. However, guys would love if you ditched the sun hat and left it at home because it's too distracting, too big, and too obnoxious. Most guys think that sun hats are unnecessarily huge, plus it generates a barricade that makes it impossible for him to give you a hug or a smooch. Number 4. Long Fake Acrylic Nails Nine times out of ten, guys won't notice a girl's fingernails unless they're extremely long, neon-colored, and madly sharp. To women, long nails bring out our feminine side. Plus, it's fun to pick out different nail shades, and to get our nails done at the salon is the ultimate stress reliever. However, long nails remind men of animal claws that can easily take an eye out and draw blood if necessary. Plus, for guys, it's a huge turnoff because they're always worried about being scratched, and it gives off the impression that you're fake. Men prefer fingernails on the natural side, and honestly, there's nothing wrong with keeping nails short and simple either. Number 3. Overalls Overalls were the staple clothing of our childhood past. Probably from the age around 5, we all remember how confusing and uncomfortable it was to wear overalls because it was hard to take them off in the bathroom. Well, the fellows are saying if you graduated from kindergarten, then it's time to retire the overalls. Not only does it ooze childish, but men claim that it doesn't look cute or fashionable at all. Wearing them out is inappropriate, and they should only be worn if you're about to do some hard labor on a farm. While many models and celebrities are starting to sport these on the runway and out in public, men are secretly hoping that overalls will disappear from the stores and closets and make their way to the garbage. Number 2. Bright Colored Lipstick Nothing makes a bold statement like wearing bright red lipstick. For a night out on the town, wearing lipstick is the last step to complete your makeup look. And while we may think lipstick makes our lips look full and flirty, that may not always be the case. First off, bright colored lipstick repels men away. Why? Well, because they don't want to get lipstick stains on their shirt. And while there's a fine line with bold lipstick, any other color other than red is a big no for them. This makes it harder for them to kiss you as they don't want to create a sloppy mess. They think that bright lipstick gives the appearance that we're trying too hard and makes us look like we've dipped our lips into candle wax. But overall, we wear makeup because we feel that it enhances our look, not the other way around. Number 1. Ugg Boots you know it's time to start wearing your Ugg boots when the temperature starts to drop slowly, the wind starts to come around, and all the girls are seen walking around with their pumpkin spice latte. In fact, these were in such high demand that girls were even wearing them outside when it was sunny. While Ugg boots may be an all-around season fashion favorite footwear, it's time for a wake-up call. Ladies, guys hate your Ugg boots. Just because they feel comfy and soft and are easy to slip on, your man might think otherwise. To be honest, they think they're straight up tacky and ugly. But what they don't understand is how unbelievably warm and cushioned our feet feel when stepping out in the winter weather. Fellas, why not try on a pair and see how much in heaven you'll feel when wearing a pair of Uggs? They might just surprise you. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Thanks for watching.